Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel for part two of this planner accessories haul. If you haven't seen part one yet, I will have it linked up in the top right corner or in the description box down below, but I'm just gonna get started here. So the first shop I have is Simply Gilded. I have some washi tape to share with you guys. This order is a little bit older, but I think some of her washi tapes she just restocked. So we have a business card here, and then we have a really pretty journaling card that comes with every Simply Gilded order. This one is World's Gold Foil, and it says, go get it gorgeous with a really pretty lipstick. And then I have a bunch of washi tapes to share with you guys, but before I unwrap them, I just wanted to show you the packaging, it's really cute. So I want to say that these four came in a set and then I purchased these two as a set and this one separately. So these are the ones that came in this set, I forgot the name, but we have these foxes with, I believe it's a rose gold foil and that's really cute. We have this one right here which is more fox, are they foxes? It doesn't feel that sticky on the back for some reason, but they look like foxes? I'm not sure what creatures they are. Pretty sure they're foxes, but it also has little bows and leaves. Just really cute. And then these two are my absolute favorites. I love that she came out with a skinny version of the bow ones. I love this version so much and I love skinny washi for some reason. So I was so happy that she came out with these and they are rose gold foiled. And then we have this one, which I also absolutely adore. This is like a vine print, also rose gold foiled. I can't wait to use this one. She also came out with a burgundy version. Those are the ones in that set. I also picked up this makeup one. Rose gold foil is my favorite, so I love this one so much. It just has like makeup products on there and I am a beauty addict. I love buying new makeup, so that one is perfect for me. And then the last one I have here is the original pink bow washi, but with rose gold foil. So I can't wait. Oops, I just knocked, knocked them over. Oh my gosh, this one has eyelashes right here. That is so cute. I can't wait to use these and put these in the rotation. And oh, this actually came in a set with this washi right here, this kind of diamond pen, and it's just, I believe it's a ballpoint. Let me do a test really quickly. Yeah, that's a ballpoint pen, so. It came in a set, and she now sells this washi tape separately. So that's everything I have from Simply Gilded. The next shop I have is Wonton in a Million. This is my first, actually it's my second order from the shop. I did order the collab with Once More With Love. This is what the packaging looks like. It's so cute. It has the Golden Gate Bridge and a bunch of dim sum. Oh, this is because I bought the Around the World collection in San Francisco. So as you can see, it is San Francisco themed, but I believe I just stuck everything in here or everything came in here. I can't remember. My sister actually opened the order because I was so excited about that. But we have a little note here from the owner, which is really sweet. So let me show you guys the San Francisco bundle first, and then I'll show you guys the individual sheets that I got. But First things first, these are the two cards that came with the order. If you guys don't know what dim sum is, I always call it like Chinese brunch. This is the washi tape that comes along. Again, it's packaged very similarly to the Simply Gilded one. Let me unwrap the washi tapes again and I'll be right back. So we have a red foiled Golden Gate Bridge, which I love. And then we have some dim sums. We have the Painted Ladies, Chinatown. Oh my gosh, there's Phil's Coffee and in and out That is so cute. There's like your Deli Square, Pier 39. I'm not going to unwrap it all the way. But that is adorable and I love all these things. And then it also came with this keychain, which I plan on putting on my car keychain whenever I get a car. So it also came with this die cut of, if you guys have ever been to Fisherman's Wharf, you guys will probably have seen some seals there. I think they're called seals. Are they called seals? I feel really dumb right now, but... Yeah, you guys have probably seen that, so we just have a die cut on matte sticker paper. Let me grab my planner so we have a size reference. So this is the San Francisco sheet that came along with the bundle. And it has a bunch of San Francisco landmarks. So if I ever want to play tourist in San Francisco, this would be perfect for that. I also picked up some individual items from the Hawaii bundle because... Hawaii is like my favorite place on earth. 
So we have this one. We have shaved ice, poke bowl. I also got the washi tape from the Hawaii bundle, which I absolutely adore as well. We have some foiled pineapples, which is so cute. We have some flowers and lays, and then I just picked up a few individual sheets here. So this one is called Family Time. My sister and I are twins, and we have a little brother, so I thought that was really perfect. Families who dim sum together stay together, and I just think it's really cute. I love using this for when we go out for lunch or do fun things together. And then I got this one. I'm all about that dim sum. Very punny. She has the funniest things. The punniest and funniest things. So this is just an assortment of dim sum. And then we have... This one, which is called Nice Buns. It has a bunch of different Chinese buns on there, which I think are really cute. And oh, that's all I got. So those are the three that I got. The next shop I have is the Station Stickers Club subscription. And I have August and September, so I'm gonna show you guys both. So this is the August one. It comes with this post-it note, which is really cute. It says Daydreams, really pretty August floral print. And then we have the packaging. I believe this is a kind of orange foil. This is actually copper foil. So we have this sheet with some circles with random sayings on there. You got this note, happy mail, goals. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. I really need to use another station stickers kit. I haven't used one in a long time. Let me move this out of the way. So we have some event stickers and some arrows, some flags, and then again, some kind of header type stickers down at the bottom. And then we have a sheet of foiled icons, which I believe is new because, well, I haven't opened a station stickers kit in a long time, but I absolutely love that this is included now. So, oh, but this is, wait, this is gold foil, whereas the rest of the kit is copper foil, so I don't really know why that is. I think this may be just an addition from her shop, I'm not sure. So you can see kind of the different foiling colors on there. But I really do like that she included some icons, that's really cute. And then we have some half boxes, more flags, some individual hearts and individual check marks. And then we have some deco and some cutout word stickers, weekend banners, bill due payday, and then some more word stickers here at the bottom. So that's what came in the August sticker stash from Station Stickers. Let me show you guys what came in September. So this one is silver foil, this is the post-it note or sticky notes that came with the set and I really like this one as well it's really pretty and then let me take these out so this is what the circles look like we have the silver foil and then again the text stickers these are actually circles right here but the bottom is blank which I like so we have the foiled flags and text stickers I this is my favorite sheet out of the entire kit these are just so pretty. Oh my goodness, I love that. We have the half boxes, flags, individual hearts, and individual checklists. Oh, this is new. We have some date covers, event stickers, and flags. I'm interested to try this format out. And again, same as the last kit, the deco and text stickers. And last but not least, we have another sheet of icons. Again, this is gold foiled as opposed to the foil in the kit, so I don't really know about that. I kind of wish that it was the color of the kit because I generally don't like to mix foils. Like the only foils I'll mix are rose gold and silver because those two are my favorite, so. But I do appreciate the extra sheet that comes along. That is what came in the September sticker stash from Station Stickers Club. So the last thing I have is this Erin Condren seasonal box. This is my first time getting this box, so I'm pretty excited. I kind of already know what's inside because I watched a couple hauls, and I'm sure you guys have watched it too. But if you guys want to hear my thoughts on it, I'll show you guys and let you guys know anyway because I always like hearing what people think of the boxes and this is my first one after all. So this is what it looks like when you open it. It's really cute. We just have a graphic card that shows us everything in the box and then we have a $10 off any coiled book which I love because I actually haven't bought my planner for next year yet. The first thing we have here is a card. It says grateful and thankful. 
I like this because it's a thank you card and we can always use more of those. I love writing handwritten thank you cards. We have another one that says celebrate. You could use this for a special occasion. And then this one says you've got this in a rose gold foil. Absolutely love the rose gold. So I, I really like those because I love having extra cards on hand for any occasion that may come up. And then we have a designer paper tape. I really like this because it's kind of November themed to me and very fall themed. And I like that I can use it for Thanksgiving week or even the week prior and the week after. I really like the colors as well. And then these are some gift labels. I'm not going to take them out because you can kind of already see it, but... I am not sure what I would use these for. I have never, I mean, I guess you could use them on, I, I have no idea what I would use these for actually, so, but I guess it's nice to have them. I don't know. I feel like they're just going to sit around and, and do nothing, but we have some markers that are dual tipped. I'm going to do a pen test with these. This is a stylized sticky notepad, and I like this a lot because for some reason, I love notepads and I just love making lists on notepads and like sticky notes and stuff like that. I've never owned an Erin Condren marker so that's what it looks like and then this is a sticky notepad. The paper is like normal copy paper but that's what the bleeding looks like on the back and the shadowing. We also have a two-sided metallic dashboard. I love this a lot. Love the rose gold foil. I think this is really pretty. Oh, wait. Oh, that's what the markers are for. Wait, can you use some markers on this? If anybody knows, please let me know down below if we can use these markers on this dashboard because that is actually really handy. I do like those markers now if you can use them on here because I don't have any markers to use on here. I think my favorite part from this box, aside from the cover, which I'll show you last, are these stickers. I think they are absolutely gorgeous. I love this watercolor kind of foiled leaf print here and oh my gosh. Where am I going to use this? I might try to pull it in one of these weeks. I'm going to try to find a kit that matches so I can use it in a weekly spread. And then this is the Halloween themed one. And I love this one as well. I think it's really cute. So those are the two sticker sheets. I'm going to open one just to see what the sticker paper is like. It's a nice thick matte paper, but the paper, the actual sticker paper is quite thin. I really do like the Erin Condren stickers, so I'm excited to use these. All right, so I just popped the cover on my planner and <laughs> my planner is starting not to close because it's so fat. But I seriously love this cover so much. Oops, zoomed in the wrong way. I'm not used to this camera. This is my vlog camera. But this is what the cover looks like on my planner. I absolutely love it. I think it's perfect for fall. It reminds me of Thanksgiving, which is one of my favorite times of year. Basically, November and December are my favorite months of the year. So I am so excited about this. I am definitely going to keep a lookout for the next seasonal surprise box. Basically, I'll probably decide if I get it based on the sneak. For this one, I saw this cover as a sneak peek, absolutely fell in love with it, and thought that if this was the theme of the entire box, I would probably love it, and I do. I love the stickers, I love the washi tape, the cards. Those are probably the th my three favorite things from this box and the $10 off a coiled book because I'm definitely gonna use that on my next planner. All right guys, that is everything I have for this haul. I just realized that I forgot two shops, so I guess I will save those for the next haul. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I got over the past few months. Thank you so much again for your support and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.